particular situation. I'm sure you have some comments. Well, I'd just like to say this, Charlie. Uh, as a result of what you're about to see with this uh, Indian strap match, Joe LaDuke challenged me to a Canadian lumberjack match. Right. That's where men surround the ring with belts. And I said, okay, I'll accept your challenge, but you've got to put up the title. So that's what I'm going to do. I'll accept his match if he'll accept mine. Now, here you see we've got the strap on. He's a big man. He jerked me around real good. But by golly, what's good for the goose is good for the gander. And I believed in choking him a little bit, but he used the oldest trick in the book. He pulled the referee right in, knocked me goofy, knocked the referee goofy. And here you see he's coming out of the straps. He's had enough. He's going to take the strap off himself, off of me. And then he's going to try to really insult me. And it was just a lucky thing that happened for him. And you'll see what happens here. He gets that strap up, and he's going to lay it down across my back real good. And, brother, this, this, this woke me up in a hurry, I'll tell you that. He laid across real good. If the referee got up and saw that the strap was off, so what he did was grab the strap, and that gave me just enough time to regain my senses there. And I jacked his jaw good, brother, and that strap went down, and I saw my chance. What I did was grab that strap, and I said, now I'm going to put a whipping on him. He likes to whip people with belts. I'm going to whip him myself. And, brother, I started whipping that boy like the end of the world, and I whipped him good till he took a powder. But taking a powder is all over. When we meet in a Canadian lumberjack match, nobody's going to leave, Charlie. When you leave, they lay those straps on your back till you come back in the ring. Joe LaDuke did challenge me. That's his match. He's never lost a Canadian lumberjack. I said, fine, I'll take your challenge, but you've got to put up your Southeastern title. He's been yelling that he's the big boy around here, that he's the Southeastern champion. That's fine. But in this one match... The it's our television main event. What the... Wait a minute. There is South trying to lower it. Look at this. This is totally uncalled for the Duke out with that belt. Beating away at Bob Armstrong. Oh. Ferris. Wait a minute. Now Mr. Olympia comes. Mr. Olympia has apparently designated himself as a substitute for Bob Armstrong. It looks like it's all right with senior referee Larry Brock. So here's our television main event, Charlie. Here it is. Uh, LaDuke leaving the television, well, going back into the dressing room of the television sports arena. Not staying out very long, just enough to do his damage and, and go back in the dressing room, Rick. A brutal attack on Bob Armstrong before ring introductions could even be made. Our slated television main event, Wayne Ferris against Bob Armstrong. Now Wayne Ferris against Mr. Olympia. And Olympia in definite trouble against the punk rocker, Charlie. Punk Rocker Olympia head first into that turnbuckle. Uh, choking away, but Olympia fires out of that corner. Olympia again rocking uh, Wayne Ferris with a series of rights to the side of the head, Rick. Mr. Olympia's career continues to catapult him towards the top of heavyweight professional wrestling, Charlie. Uh, along the way, this man has held many titles, including the State of Alabama Heavyweight Championship, the Mississippi Heavyweight Championship, Mid-South Tag Team, Southeastern Tag Team, a host of regional and national titles. Olympia! There's his own version of a sleeper Wayne Ferris is so well known for. Ferris, knowing what was about to happen, just makes a desperate lunge for those ropes, Rick. The sleeper, Wayne Ferris, his own favorite hold. Ferris managed to catapult Olympia onto the floor of the television sports studio. Olympia blocks the right hand from Wayne Ferris. And now both men fighting on the floor of the television studio, Charlie. Time remaining in this match. Uh, television time remaining. Olympia and punk rock Wayne Ferris, hopefully. Uh, certainly disgusting. LaDuke not coming out to make any comments about his uh, uh, his just a moment ago attack on Bob Arm. Brad Armstrong. Welcome to Southeastern Championship Wrestling. Innovators in television wrestling.